So I started my day with a apple pie, a cherry pie, a pot of beans for Lee, and now I'm off to get the feed. over here that um, is part of the historical museum it's I don't know what year it's from shame on me <laughs> but this is about 30 minutes to 45 minutes away from our home so if we stay in town and get feed it's $20 a sack if I come here it's about $6.50 per a sack so you can see we come to the end of this um, thing and here is all of the mill um, these big silos and we're just going to turn right in here. There's a lot of people trying to get feed before the holidays so um, we'll go right up here. A lot of noise, a lot of things going on. Big rigs coming in. This is where they weigh the grain. Um, these are actual customers parking and uh, yeah we'll get in here and see if we can get our feed picked up before the Okay holidays. you saw the big rig come in before local farmers will come in with a tub. They weigh in empty and then when they bring their grain across this big scale right here that's how it gets um, they get a weight on it. There's a weight uh, monitor on the inside so right here is you know the big scale where that semi was and even local people bring theirs to here and have it all weighed and then they'll go all right so now I've come out from paying and I'm gonna go right over that door back in and they're gonna load my feed right into the back of my truck so all of these right here have different grains different storage systems and all that kind of stuff it's kind of wholesale at its finest but the farmer pays retail so just say but all right I gotta get off here load it out and the truck that you saw coming in is now unloading her corn or soybean meal um, they take all whole um, grown feeds or seeds I guess you'd say but anyway this is our little mill it's not anything fancy but it is kind of industrial old-fashioned mill so we like it but we're gonna head home they make my custom mix it's a whole lot cheaper here than it is in town Stoked up the uh, fire. Got my pumpkin in here, and I'm getting ready to make pumpkin pies next. So I'm going to bake some cookies to get them out of the fridge, and then hopefully be done by tonight to go pick up a steer. I got this right. All right. So here's my invoice um, from my feed, and what I wanted to show you is 
122.75 for a thousand pounds of feed. Now you've got a roll feed in here. Of course, ours has corn, milo, oats, and then there's a um, sacking fee. Uh, so it just has random little charge, but the 122.75 includes everything. Now, if you break that down, a thousand pounds equals 20 50 pound bags. 122.75 divided by the 20 bags equals six dollars and 14 cents a bag. Is it worth it for me to drive 40 minutes each way to get feed? Oh, yeah, the cheapest you can find feed at your local farm supply or whatever is going to be about $10 a bag. Here in our part of the country, you can get it up to 18 Some of them are $22 a bag. So a um, 1,000 pounds, 20 bags at $6.14 per bag. So worth going to the mill.